hi aries welcome back welcome back to my channel um it is always a blessing to have you guys back here this is going to be your next 24 in love only so if you want to find out what's going about your love life honey dearly, this is a read for you guys now if you are here for your very first time i welcome you and if you are returning welcome back welcome back welcome back for the ones that are new here we do pray here on the channel i pray is a muscle i am going to tap into your energy pull in a quick prayer first and see what's going on with your next 24 in love okay let's pray heavenly father as i go along my day i ask that you bless myself and i ask that you bless my secrets heavenly father please send your most powerful angels to take charge over this reading using my body as a vessel giving me the right words and giving me the right messages that you want me to share the ones that needs to know heavenly father i do give you all the honor and all the praise in jesus name we pray amen all right, my darling. So this reading is a general reading, okay? And it's not a personal one. That means it may or it may not resonate with you. Just take what does leave the rest for somebody else, okay? Place your situation where you need to place a situation. That is not for me to do. That is for you to do. And also, my darlings, the roles could be reversed because it is a general reading, okay? Now, for cross watchers, that also applies for you as well. Okay, and if you do need to have a personal reading, you can always connect with me using the information that you will find in the description part of this video to make an appointment to have a personal reading done. And my cards are flipped. All right. All right, so let's see what's happening here. All right, angels, what's coming in towards Aries in love? Past, present, and future situation. What's coming in towards Aries in love? Next 24 hours. Next 24. Next 24, please. Okay. Next 24. Oh, wow. Emotions are running wild here is what I'm seeing. Emotions are running wild. It's like the emotions that I see running wild here, okay? Next 24 is bringing in higher self, okay? Higher self, for some of you just need to really start tapping into spiritual form here and praying more. For some of you really manifesting your life, okay? Because you cannot continue this journey in emotions, okay? Okay? Um, I'm, I'm getting set back. Somebody is being set back here. Let's see. Next 24, next 24, next 24. Okay. Let's see what's happening here. So I'm getting the unknown. That's what's coming true with the next 24. So someone is walking into unknown territory here, but it's time that you take a break and rest. Okay. It's time that you also take a look in the mirror and see the reflection what is looking back at you. All right. Um, what is looking back at you, you should know that this is your integrity and your integrity needs some kind of an alignment here. This alignment is called change, synchronicity, change. It's time to let go, it's time to release, it's time to fly high like a butterfly. Next 24. Next 24, please. What is the next 24? Okay. All right. So I'm getting your money, y'all. I'm getting your money. Your money also needs some kind of alignment here. Let's see. What's this? Okay. I'm getting social media. So maybe somebody's spending their money on social media. Maybe, who knows? What is this social media business? Okay, so there's a light in the dark. So there's something that's happening here on social media where money is concerned, where somebody doesn't want somebody to know that they're in fact spending money because of social media situation. Let's see. What's this? What is this social media? What is this social media? Next 24. Okay, so there's a limited belief here. There's this limited belief with social media. Someone believes that what they're doing is right. There's nothing wrong with this. What is this? Okay, yeah. So somebody's out playing on social media. 
Why am I hearing hookups? Listen, what's this? What's this that I'm hearing? Social media. Okay, so, yep. Text message. So, there's a lot of back and forth. Somebody is hooking up with somebody on social media here. That's what I'm seeing here. It is calling for change. Mm hmm All right. Let's see. What is this? All right. It's calling for change. And there's a fear here. Now, why am I hearing that someone is fearful that their intuition was right in the present? Let's see. Next 48. No, not next 48, y'all. Next 24. All right. So there's a player in the mist. Somebody's playing games on social media and being a snake. Very snakeified energy. What is this? What is this that I'm seeing? Next 24 hours. Next 24, please. What's coming in towards Aries within the next 24 in love? Somebody's wearing a mask with you, okay? There's a mask that's been worn here. You should know, use wisdom with this situation. This could involve a marriage here. Now, what I'm getting is that this marriage may feel like someone is either regretful of what's going on because they might have found out the truth here. But the beacon is telling me that you have to rise from this, okay? Because new love is on the way, okay? I'm hearing keep going for some of you. Next 24. Tell me more, angels. Tell me more. Next 24, please. Next 24, in love. Next 24, in love, please. What is this? All right. So it's time that you maybe use your third eye. For some of you, maybe using a blind eye here. Um, I'm getting that you need to be using your third eye, okay, with this situation here. Not, do not have fear. Have you closed in your eyes because there's an ex-lover in the mess. Somebody's either calling their ex. This is what I'm seeing, y'all. All right, next 24. This is a cosmic flow. They've done this before, okay, but you are enough. And you just deal with a situation that is connected to mystery, that's why you're feeling the way that you're feeling. Let's see here. Next 24, please. Next 24 in love. Next 24 in love. Next 24. Okay. All right. Just roll the dice is what angels is saying here. It's time that you make some damn changes is what that means. Roll the dice. Let somebody see a side of you that they know that they never knew existed. Okay? It's time that you make some changes within oneself because, honey, there's a player in the mist. Okay? This player is uh, good at the game, but they're about to get caught. For some of you, this person might have already gotten caught with their own game. Next 24. Clarify some things, angels. All right, let's see what angels wants you to know within the next 24 hours here. Messages, please. Clarify the past, please. Clarify the past. Next 24. All right, so we have the king of wands in the reverse. Okay. All right, we have the nine of cups here. And we have the seven of swords in the reverse. So you're about to walk away from a lot of conflicts here from your past is what I'm seeing, okay? You have definitely, either you've tried or you are, okay? You're walking away. You have tried to close a chapter in your life, all right? Um, I do see um, a situation where you might have invested a lot of time into your person, okay? And so maybe you they did as well. But because of the connection, the connection has definitely been lost because I'm feeling like there was no communication that was coming through in the past year. For whatever reason, someone decided to be um, very mischievous here, okay? To the point where someone had to make a solid decision, walk away from happiness. Now, as far as the present is concerned, we have the Four of Cups, we have the Six of Pentacles in the reverse, and we do have the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse, all right? So the manifestation the kind of process kind of came to a halt, Okay? Um, I do feel like at the present, someone just did not want to give anything else. I, I'm feeling like, you know, 
time was invested, love was invested, care was invested, building stability here was invested. You've given a lot of you in here, but now because you have not been receiving what you've been given, you're about to walk away with your head held high because all this frustration here that's coming from this four of cups and sadness and, and feeling bored of, of wanting this person to really give to you in the present is not giving the way you want it to give. So now you're blocking this energy um, and you're just taking back your peace, okay? Because someone is, is deliberately not even listening to a word you have to say at this present moment, okay? All right, so let's see what's coming towards you in the in the future here. Um, next twenty four. So we have the nine of the Knight of Pentacles reverse, the Page of Cups here. All right, so this person wants to come back towards you. They're coming back towards you for some kind of a missed opportunity here. Okay, um, they I'm seeing an apology that's coming in. They want to apologize. Um, they're sorry for what they have done. Um, they want to come in and kind of give you a big old hug and a big old kiss all over again. Um, I do feel like for some of you, this apology feels more, at times it feels sincere, but at times it feels kind of weak, okay? Because we also have this Knight of Pentacles also being in the reverse. It's like they're unsure at times where they even would have want to place themselves. It's like they want to come in, but they have one foot in and one foot out the door, uh, but what I do see them coming towards you with is some kind of an offer here. Um, some of you, this person might have realized finally that you are the it factor. And because they have realized that. But some of you, listen, this might be a little bit too late because you might have already moved on to someone else already. Maybe you, maybe you have another offer somewhere of love, okay? But this person is definitely not, they're not done with this relationship yet. They are still kind of hoping that they will kind of still have a place in your heart for you to kind of go back and kind of give them another chance in your life here. All right, let me get an overall read here. What's the overall in love? Next 24, please. What is the overall in love for Aries within the next 24? Overall energy, please. All right, so we have the overall as the Ten of Swords, the Six of Swords, and the World. In the back of the deck, we have the five of wands in the reverse. I do feel like you're you're done fighting a battle with this person or anything that is attached to your energy at this point, okay? You don't want to fight battles anymore. You don't want to argue with anyone. You don't want to deal with conflicts. You don't want to walk, with, um, walk around with people that's bringing negativity into your energy. You're walking away with peace here. You don't want to put up any resistance. You want... A resistance of manifestation only. You're on a manifestation type of an energy. You're not dealing with players anymore. That's for sure. You don't want to do that anymore. Or having this person bring fear towards you to slow the process of maturity. Okay. Um, you're walking away. The six of swords. You're making a decision or you're making a choice for yourself <clears throat> moving forward. It's what I see coming in your overall. Okay. You're making a decision to move away from this because. You have definitely dealt with some kind of a master major betrayal here, okay? Um, for some of you, you um you might be still kind of feeling that kind of pain even today, even though you're walking away from this, even though you're trying to escape what you have been dealt with here, you still have this pain here that you're dealing with. But what I do see coming in though is a sense of rejuvenation. I feel like you will definitely arise from what you have been dealing with. Versus past, versus present, versus now. I see you moving into another chapter of your life. I see blessings coming towards you here. A um, major blessings, okay? So if you're planning on doing like a, something new or, or a business or if you're planning on moving away and starting something fresh, this is the perfect time to go ahead and do it because this is what I see you doing, okay? Um, you're moving away. You're moving away. Um, you just want to start something else. You want to embrace this new chapter, this new you. Um, this new blessings here and it is going to happen uh, but you have to stay focused is what I'm hearing you have to stay focused because if you open this door of conception where people could think it's okay to come on in because remember this person is not done with you yet they still feel like they have unfinished business with you so they are coming in for the second chance okay and what I'm hearing is that second chance that's coming through with your overall it will kind of sound real good. It's going to be some things for some of you that you've always wanted to hear. And not just say that this person is not being sincere. It's just that you have to be sure 
that what you are ready to receive and to let back in his way is because you want that to be and not because somebody else says they're going to change. Um, but you have to see that change within them and you have to be able to change within oneself as well. Okay. Because there's, for some of you, you need to know this before you make a final decision to let this person back in your life. Just know that there is another opportunity. There's another door of happiness that's coming towards you. Someone else, for some of you, you might have met someone already. If you have not met someone already, someone is definitely coming in towards you, okay? Now, this person really wants to, to love you. This person wants to build stability with you. This person wants to build an empire with you and, and, and take this love to another dimension in your life all right and this could be you as well you want to have a happy ending trying something different walking into something new trying to love again in the new form okay is what i see you doing here and this also resonates to who's coming in towards you to love you to build this dream over here with you okay um and i'm hearing a marriage too um but you must still be searching for answers here but the answers that you see is as soon as you start planting these seeds, okay? Don't just stand there and wonder if. Just go ahead and do it. Go ahead and plant these seeds. This is the Page of Pentacles. You're investing in you, okay? You're investing in you. You're investing in your happiness. You're investing in your peace. You're investing in your stability. This is what I see coming towards you, my darlings. We're in the next 24. Investing, investing, investing into your happiness, all right? This happiness will have you finding the love that you need and rising as the Queen of Cups do, okay? It's all about manifestations, all about taking back your joy. It's all about taking back your peace here to know that um, you should not be able to accept things that is not placed to, to accept. To know that um, you have to take a role and it has been a leadership role to know that um alignment is needed with the perfect timing tapping into one's higher self okay walking away from anything that is dangerous in your present and aligning yourself what is new and this is what i see coming in new okay even though i feel like you're still searching for clarity to because you don't want to you see you're trying not to go back into what you had to deal with here all right, even though I feel like you still go back and forth with the present for some of you, it still lingers in the past and the now, all right? But you're trying to kind of separate yourself from things that have made you feel really sad is what I'm feeling. And this is where this clarity is coming in. This is where this change is needed here. But just know that the situation is, is saying it's limited. So it's not a permanent setting. It is just one that needs a bit of alignment, okay? So this is your next 24 um, and I think we're good for today. Okay. I love you guys to the moon and stars. I'll probably post one more on late for later on, but that is going to be a couple of videos that you might've already seen because honey, I, like I said a million times, you guys are not getting my notifications. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and attach like three reads already together. So you guys will see that later on as well. Okay. I love you guys to the moon and stars. Thumbs up the videos for me on your way out. Let me know down below if you do need to have a prayer request. Pray for me as I'll be praying for you. And with that said, always remember to seek first and you'll always find later.